my way to Bodega Bay and here are some of my favorite places to stop. And if you like the small town community feel with local restaurants and shops, this is going to be the place for you. in the mid-1800s, starting off with the post office as a trade center. Uh, in terms of real estate, you're going to find a lot of these little charming older homes. Your average square footage right now is about 650 versus the 550 Sonoma County average. So just keep in mind, you will be paying quite a bit more on your home here in Sebastopol. festival for entertainment or food, you have to check out Hop Hop. They have a stage with live music, some great food, or if you want to try out a variety of foods, go check out the Barlow or downtown Sebastopol has lots of foods to offer. So we left Sebastopol and we're on our way out to Bodega Bay and one place that you have to stop is the Freestone Wildflower Bakery. Um, they have some great assortment on breads and scones. So if you like country living, you might want to check out the real estate here on the way to Bodega Bay. Um, you have wide open spaces, big lots with ranch style homes. I'm here in the town of Bodega and the church behind me might seem familiar to you. This is uh, from the movie The Birds from Alfred Hitchcock. And here in Bodega, you're going to find a couple of local uh, surf shops, coffee shops. You got to go check them out. All right, so we finally made it to Bodega Bay. And please note, the weather can change here substantially. You can have 100 degrees over in Santa Rosa. You come over here and it's going to be foggy, cloudy, and 60 degrees. So always bring a jacket. So if you want to enjoy a great sit-down lunch with some beautiful views, you do have to come by and uh, check out the Tides restaurant. But if you like the quick outdoor snack, you have to check out my favorite place is Spud's Crab Company. They have the best crab sandwiches. And if you come here on the weekend, you're gonna get some crab cakes. Like what you saw and you want to check out any of my other neighborhoods, 
please subscribe below and comment if there's any particular community that you want me to feature. Take care!